there are some areas of research, and, and this is where I'm particularly interested as my focus, where AI essentially steps into the shoes of people and automates something that people used to do. And in some areas, like with drug discovery and repurposing or with materials engineering, are doing the sorts of things that used to make human beings actually inventors on things like patents. And I'm a law professor, so my interest in this is largely legal. And to me, it is interesting how even though you can have a person and a machine do exactly the same thing, the law will treat these differently. So for example, if an AI invents something now, a company may not be able to file for a patent on it because inventions need human inventors. And modernly, there may be some times when you don't have a traditional human inventor um, because some team of people is licensing a pre-trained AI developed by another team and the AI identifies the value of its output or another AI does. For example, if you train an AI on a bunch of car suspensions and it randomly alters these to generate 100,000 new car suspensions and then it runs them through modeling software and says, by the way, this design is significantly better than the last design. If you had people do that, you could get a patent. But if you have machines do that, maybe you can't. 